Lucky number seven on your mark, get set, go. Okay, so this is the this is a race for the last two spots. Last two spots up for grabs, and we start the break open. Hopefully, we get that twenty-two hundred dollar estimated value coin or just something epic. Three, two, one. Tristan B has got a couple spots by way of race. So congratulations, Trist. By way of race, bro. Each list will go through seven times. We'll stack the lists up side by side. Okay, lucky number seven. Okay, seven times. There is the first list finished. So there is the first list. Okay. So here come the years. It's not a year that falls in, in this list. We'll simply randomize between all the owners. Lucky number seven. Big Hit Boulevard. Let's go. Let's go. Now you can see your years. So Tristan B, you have 1895. Frank G, 1894. All the way down, and these aren't really bold it out so we're going to fix that and bold them and you can see here 1886 for Michael Weeks let's see what happens man come on big gold coin I want to see something legendary I want to see something that hit the big board the big pulse page What's it going to be coming out of here? International Gold Edition. Ho! 
<laughs> Come on, treasure. What is it? Oh, this is a hot box. Oh, my. <laughs> this is a bonus. And if no one has the year, then this gold bullion, I guess you could call it, yeah. Swiss gold bar gets random between everybody. I'm going to see if there's a year identifier on it. Well, let's look at the coin hit. We'll come back to this. What's the coin hit? It's a Liberty. Oh, this looks like an American coin, silver dollar. Oh, 1922 is the year. Okay, so there's some there's some details here. It's a MS sixty three from nineteen twenty two. Nice. All right. So that is a very special Liberty coin. You can see the the. Uh, this is this is really cool. Congratulations. I I guess you call that a fedora. I don't know what you call. It. I think you call it a fedora. I don't know. I can't think of the word. Nineteen twenty two, who's got it? Who's got 22? It's Tristan B. Look at there. Oh, my. All right, what about our bullion, man? Tristan, congratulations with your silver dollar. Silver dollar. Any year on this? I mean, I'd be kind of surprised there wasn't a year on it. Let me see what's going on with this thing. I don't know, it just says, uh, you know, it's it's a gram, and it tells a percentage of the gold, right? I don't see a year there. Okay, yep, gram, okay, certification number. If there's no year identifier on this, that's easy to see, man. It's going to random. Anybody see a year on this? What do you think? Anybody? Do we random it? Ho! I think so. There's no year. There's no year on this thing. Swiss made. I'm surprised it won't. Won't we'll focus on that. I don't know what the deal is. Okay. Yeah, look at that. That's really cool, man. That's beautiful. Fine, fine uh, bullion there. And it's a picture of this. I mean, that's the picture on the gold bar. It's like a woman who's blindfolded, maybe. I guess that's what it is. With a fruit basket. I don't know. It's, it could be. And maybe that's olives. I don't know. It's like an ancient trading thing. I don't know. Yeah, I don't see any year on it, man. Let's go. There's no year. that There might be a year you could figure it out, you know, doing the barcode, but we're not going by that. Let's do a random. What is that top list after seven? Big Hit Boulevard. Some gold bullion. Got a gram of gold on the line. Yeah, 
This is one of the hot boxes that has a gram of gold. All right. Everybody's included. Seven times three winners on the top list after seven. Lucky number seven. Tristan B. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. The coin and the gold bar. Nice going, man. You're so lucky. You are lucky as can be. <laughs> so we're out of this kind of coin break. This was the international one, even though we got an American one. It was the international coin. It was gold international. We had a silver dollar. Um, but there is another coin break. It's kind of silly, a silver dollar. But it is, it is uh, they say that, you know, those can come out. It's not like some kind of crazy error. Or anything. Those are, those are designed to possibly come out. So it's a hundred dollar coin. Okay. Nice. I did not know that. That's cool. I like this because you can look these up pretty easy. I mean, a graded coin's a graded coin. Those liberties, I mean, you just it's an MS sixty three. So these are very easy for the values to be looked up because they are the most reputable grading company. It's not like you're getting Bob's grading or something like that. You're getting the most reputable grading company on a coin. And so they're very easy to determine the values of these. And uh, you can see the estimated values in the description. There is another one, um, the American edition, All-American edition. And so, yeah, that's exciting, fun stuff to get into. There are some big hits around there. Hope. And, uh, yeah, we'll be looking forward to more breaks of those coins around here. <laughs>